What do you want to sit down to my blood frame tonight if we were a guy that rock and life? I didn't really know Tony particularly well um, as, a, like, as a person, but uh, when I was a kid, I used to go see Moe's for them all the time. And that kind of. Because it was funny, I always felt like in the 90s punk rock thing, there was kind of Green Day and Elstring were here, but then, which was kind of one thing, but then underneath was the bit that I loved a bit more, which was No Effects, Moe's for Men, Mario Wagon, and Pennywise. Offspring kind of got me into it, fair enough, but I think I loved it. No effects and nice women more. And I used to see them in London all the fucking time. And then Tony did solo stuff and we kind of crossed paths a few times doing solo records and stuff and he was a nice dude and I thought he wrote great songs. You know, when Johnny Cash died, that's one thing, because he's Johnny Cash, he's fucking old. You know what I mean? And Tony Slide dying was just like, he's not fucking old, he's like one of our. And you know, and it really kind of made me pretty sad when I heard about it. And then for the compilation, Mike from NoFX called me and asked me to do a song for it. I said, cool, yeah, send me the list of songs and then the, the, show me which ones somebody's already picked or whatever and I'll pick a song. And I was going through that and then I got an email from um, Tony's wife who said that she wanted me to do Kira because um, it was a song for the Tony wife for his daughter. And that was kind of, at the same time, that was a really cool thing and a really incredibly sad thing to hear as well. You know? So, but I mean, of course, I said, yes, I thought, yeah, okay, no worries. So, I kind of did a weird version of it as well. I was kind of doing, I was trying to find the right mood for it, and in the end, I actually ended up hanging the microphone out of the window of my flat in London, over the road, and then playing it from quite a long way away, so you can't really hear it all that well. But it just seemed like the right thing to have sounds of movement in the road. Maybe I'm no good at this, then. 